The humanoid robotic scene worldwide is going out of hand. In the past six months, we have seen robots that walk like humans, talk like humans, and even gather environmental contexts like humans. This existence is both exciting and terrifying at the same time. From newbie newcomers like Meta and Figure to trailblazers like Boston Dynamics, everyone's jumping onto the bandwagon. Chinese startups are racing to dominate this space too. The pace is so insane, it's easy to feel completely overwhelmed. But today, you don't need to worry if you're feeling lost, because we're going to cover all the somewhat terrifying and not so terrifying humanoid updates from July 2023 till present day in 2024. The scene for a huge humanoid explosion was set back in the month of May last year, when robotics companies attracted $686 million from 61 different investments. This boosted the total robotics funding for the year to around $4 billion. For some context, back in April, funding was even higher, hitting $1.63 billion, while March saw $526 million. February $620 million and January $521 million in investments. What happened next was a wild ride of groundbreaking innovation and reckless progress. It's a story of humanity's rush toward a future where we're free from tedious labor and boring jobs. To kick things off, we have a mecha, a cutting-edge humanoid robot developed by Engineered Arts. It's designed to mimic human expressions and movements with remarkable realism. Equipped with microphones, cameras, and facial recognition systems, a mecha engages people naturally. This robot showcased that we must get ready to witness robots behave similar to humans. This was all due to its unparalleled levels of dexterity. Boasting a mammoth 24 motors just for facial expressions, 20 motors per arm and 12 per hand for gestures, the robot could do tasks involving writing, typing, playing instruments, and solving puzzles. Then came the collaboration from OpenAI and Norwegian startup OneX, leading to the introduction of NEO. Resembling a futuristic astronaut, NEO boasts mobility, manipulation skills, and sensory abilities through its arms, legs, cameras, speakers, microphones, and sensors. OpenAI, however, was just too rich and fancy to stick to one humanoid project. They worked on NEO and integrated advanced AI systems like GPT-4 and DALL-E for the brains of this humanoid. Beyond physical capabilities, NEO learns, comprehends commands, and creates content such as images and code. Unveiled at the NEO Accelerator, it embodies OpenAI's pursuit for artificial general intelligence aiming to perform any human task. NEO was unveiled in July 2023 at the NEO Accelerator, a startup accelerator founded by Silicon Valley investor Ali Partovi. But who knew that OpenAI takes AGI way too seriously? And the developments that are next to come in this video are sure to shock you if you are new to the world of AI. While things were heating up in the US, the Chinese tech circle decided that they could not just stand by and watch the US take all the glory. And literally, the Chinese went guns blazing. Check out EX Robots. They've nailed real-time facial replication, so these bots can mirror your every expression instantly. They claim these robots can chat and respond naturally to humans. Behind these realistic faces are these cool movable electric units mimicking muscles and movements, using data from real human faces for accuracy. But these robots aren't just for show. They're aiming for serious gigs like teaching, healthcare, and hospitality. Then there's Cloud Minds, kicking it up with robots that connect to the cloud. These bots tap into a huge pool of real-time info, like having the world's knowledge at their fingertips. Remember Cyborg from Justice League? People at this company created one without harnessing the power of mother boxes. Powered by Harrix, a cloud-based brain, these humanoids are constantly learning and adapting. Xiaomi's in the game too, with Cyber One, a humanoid assistant that walks, talks, and reads emotions. It manages your day, controls gadgets, and cracks not-so-funny jokes. With AI smarts and sensors, Cyber One keeps you updated on everything from weather to groceries. While China and the US were competing to take the edge, Korea was working on a different kind of problem. 
they decided to work on the loneliness astronauts have to deal with during long duration space flights. And they came up with Laika. Named after the first space travel dog, Laika integrates mixed reality for interactive updates with astronauts, symbolizing a bold step in advanced robotics for space exploration. Built with a robust titanium body, Laika boasts an array of sensors including depth cameras, thermal imaging, ultrasonic and ECG sensors, enabling it to detect objects, people and monitor astronaut health. Leica provides emotional support through lifelike movements and features an ECG sensor in its neck for real-time health monitoring. The first demonstrations were revealed back in November 2023, but the idea is still in its preliminary stages. We've addressed pretty much all the major updates from new startups to established companies making their way into the humanoid robotics scene. Now, it's time to talk about the big guns who influence the industry not only by what they release, but also by what they say. Yes, I'm talking about Elon Musk. Tesla shook things up on December 1st, 2023, with the launch of its latest humanoid robot, Optimus Gen 2. This upgraded version comes packed with improvements aimed at boosting performance. Tesla engineered actuators and sensors promise better control. A 2DOF actuated neck allows for more precise movements, integrated electronics enhance efficiency, a 30% speed increase means it can now walk at 0.6 meters per second, foot force or torque sensing ensures stability, actuated toe sections mimic human feet, a weight reduction of 10 kg boosts agility, enhanced balance and control facilitate complex tasks, brand new 11DOF hands are designed for delicate object manipulation, and tactile sensing on all fingers improves interaction with objects. Tesla plans to deploy Optimus Gen 2 in its manufacturing and eventually sell it, with CEO Elon Musk banking on its potential to drive a majority of Tesla's long-term value. And that's not all. A groundbreaking Neuralink event featuring its first patient, Nolan Arbor, paralyzed from the shoulders, showcased how he could control his computer via his thoughts. Despite early successes, challenges remain, with ongoing FDA scrutiny and acknowledgement of the technology's infancy. Let alone Neuralink, big updates also hailed from the headquarters of Boston Dynamics. They introduced an electric version of its Atlas robot, replacing hydraulic systems for quieter operation. This advanced Atlas demonstrates smoother movements and a streamlined design, similar to the company's Spot robot. Sanctuary AI announced a collaboration with Microsoft to develop next-gen AI models for versatile robots, leveraging Azure Cloud. This partnership aims to accelerate large behavior models development, critical for achieving artificial general intelligence. Sanctuary AI's seventh-gen robot Phoenix showcases enhanced capabilities in visual perception and human-like motion, making substantial progress since its previous iteration. Moving back to China, Unitree also just released the trailer for their new G1 humanoid robot, and it was actually mind-blowing. Let's break it down. First off, the G1 starts at just $116,000, which is way cheaper than any other humanoid robot with these capabilities. In the demo, what really stood out was its insane flexibility and range of motion. Unlike other robots that might need external support to stay balanced, the G1 can take a hit and remain stable on its feet, thanks to its internalized wiring and advanced engineering. Speed-wise, it's impressive too, reaching speeds of 3.3 meters per second, almost as fast as running. And its ability to learn tasks through simulation and apply them autonomously in the real world is groundbreaking. This means it can perform complex actions with precision, which opens up new possibilities in manufacturing and beyond. The G1's hands are another highlight. They're incredibly dexterous, capable of delicate tasks like soldering electronic components or simply crushing a walnut. Plus, they've integrated an AI system, the Unitree Robot Unified Large Model, which seems to enhance its autonomy and capabilities even further. On April 26, 2024, Shenzhen-based company Stardust introduced Astribot, drawing its name from the Latin proverb ad astra per aspera meaning through hardships to the stars. The official demonstration highlighted Astrobot's standout features, superior operating performance, maneuverability, and accuracy. 
It showcased the robot's versatility through tasks like sandwich flipping, wine pouring, and Chinese calligraphy. The video underscored Astrobot's adaptability, demonstrating it vacuuming pieces of paper, misting plants, and plugging in lamps with precision. Astrobot S1's human-like movements are driven by machine learning, learning from extensive datasets via imitation learning. Uptech's latest creation, the Walker S, was seriously underrated in its recent debut, both in media coverage and online buzz. Founded in 2012 in Shenzhen, Uptech unveiled the Walker S alongside executives in Hong Kong last year. The demo showcased its modular design with detachable hands, hinting at future upgrades and versatile applications, aligning with trends from Agility Robotics and Boston Dynamics. Powered by Baidu's ErnieBot AI platform, the Walker S holds its own in natural conversation, possibly responding even quicker than its American counterparts. Its real-time pick-and-place abilities and adaptive task handling make it a solid contender for manufacturing roles, despite currently lagging humans in speed. Via depth sensors, vision cameras, and 3D object recognition, the Walker S navigates environments efficiently, geared for industrial settings. Although technical details are scarce without its listing on Uptech's website, its appearance blends Optimus-like aesthetics with Figure 01 vibes, suggesting promising AI and robotics advancements ahead, especially with NVIDIA's entry into the fray. All three of these robots were touted as China's answer to OpenAI's biggest release of the year, the Figure 1 robot. So let's talk about Figure 1. Founded in 2022 by Brett Adcock, the startup figure aims to revolutionize robotics. Their Figure 01 is touted as the world's first commercially viable, general-purpose humanoid robot, designed to think, learn, and interact with its surroundings, addressing labor shortages. Standing at 1.6 meters tall and weighing 60 kg with a 20 kg payload, the Figure 1 runs for 5 hours on a single charge. It's sleek and compact, featuring 41 degrees of freedom for agile movement across its arms, waist, legs, and hands. Figure collaborated with OpenAI for building the brains of this robot, and when a video popped up a few months back where it was seen interacting with a human while considering environmental references, the internet went ablaze. Some called it AGI, some called it Sam Altman's death wish. No matter what it is, it truly showcases how impactful the merger of AI with robotics can be. One video is simply not enough to cover all the aspects of humanoids, like NVIDIA's new Blackwell GPUs and how they are set to impact the entire humanoid scene, so you can expect a follow-up video soon. However, if you feel lost about AI, like you fail to understand its transition from a fancy tech term to a profound industry, I have made another video discussing its entire history. Click now, and I'll catch you there in a second.